Hey Bethany. Um, Brittany. Blair. Hey Blair. <laughs> um, so this is going to be my entry for your 65,000 subscriber contest. I know, right? Big deal. Um, you got so many um, subscribers by lying to people. That's amazing. But I'm going to enter your contest because I want brushes. So, I mean, that's the gist of it all. And I'm a subscriber, so I qualify. Cool. So, um, my character of choice um, is actually a movie character. It's actually a couple of characters, but it's all, they're all played by the same actors. So, um, I guess you could say this is inspired by the actor. They look the same in every movie. Like, the makeup's the same in every movie. So... I guess you can say that it's really inspired by the actor, but whatever. So, my choice was um, the character Jinxie from Meet the Parents slash Meet the Fuckers. Um, um, the actor's name is Bear, and um, he was also sassy in Homeward Bound. So, I guess we'll go with sassy because since you know makeup is for girls um and sassy is a female character i guess we'll go with sassy this is my sassy inspired look um i just incorporated the colors the eye color is in the liner and the colors of the fur um of the characters so that's where i went and just so happens that your play sister l um, owns Bear, and I know that you know Bear, so this is kind of me sucking up, and I know that's how you win, to suck up to the person hosting the contest, and I have no shame. So this is me sucking up to you by using one of your pets as inspiration, but, so yeah, I hope you like it, and stay tuned if you want to check out this look. Alright, so for starters, I've already primed my lid lower and upper lid with the uh, benefit FYI. So let's get it cracking. So the first color I'm going to take is from the Coastal Sense 88 matte palette. It's actually the first two colors. You can get all the way over here and take these two colors and just mix them back and forth a little bit. Because we know that uh, Sassy or Jinxy or whoever has kind of an off tannish tone fur for the most part. So, put that lightest color, lightest fur color is what we're going to call it on the lid. Next color I'm going to take, and I'm just going to take it on that same brush, on the tip of the brush, the darkest brown and the black. These two right here down in the corner. Mix them back and forth on the tip of the brush. So we have kind of a really, really a darker brown. That brown's already really dark, but we want it to be darker. And then I'm going to take that and right on my brow bone. I'm just gonna sketch out a shape, which is kind of just like a circle. And this color is like kind of like how the tips of a Jinxie's fur are in areas where he's darker. Is what this color is for. So just blend it, kind of try to soften up the line on the bottom half of it. And you also want to take that color and pull it down underneath the eyes. And I'm just going to take a blending crease brush and I'm going to take this grayish brown that's right here. Because Jinxie's kind of got that dirty gray. And that's going to go right in the crease between the lid color and the other color to blend them together. So it's just going to go right in there. And then I'm going to go back in with the darker brown color. Bring that color back once again. Alright, so I have that. We're pretty even. Good enough. Alright, and that's pretty much it for the eyeshadow. So it's kind of like jinxy feist. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my NYX Jumbo Pencil in Milk. And... A little liner brush I can find it like this and I'm just gonna um, get a load up my brush if you have just a regular uh, white kind of like liquid or cream liner that would probably work better but I don't so this is what I'm using making do with what I have and I'm gonna make out this shape um, 
probably gonna end up in and out because it's gonna take me a while but you're just creating this shape in white on this side all right so you should end up with something like this and then over top of that I just took um, two pigments one that's this color this yellow one right here and this lighter green one right here and I mix those two together so those two right there just to get a little bit more so more yellow than green just to get kind of a this color like a greenish yellow to for the eye color that bear jinxie sassy has and I'm just gonna take a little small shadow brush like this and then take that mixture and I'm gonna spray my brush with fix plus you can use any type of moisture and just pick up some of that color and I'm just gonna cover the white with that color so basically I created a liner that's that color it's pretty much all I did. So just go ahead and cover that up. Alright, so you should end up with something like this. And I tried to do it without the white base before and it just didn't work. It just didn't work. It really had nothing to stick to, and since uh, and the eyeliner seal I had wasn't really making an eyeliner, so that's how I used it. So the next step is just a black liner. So um, just as thin as possible, you want to um, line your upper lash line in a cat-like um, way, and um, we're just going to create a, create a nice shape. And then just go ahead and do your waterline. So you should have something, a shape like this. Mine's kind of messy because I'm not used to like dramatic style liners. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and do the other side and add mascara to my top and bottom lashes. Alright, so mascara and liner done, liner done for both eyes and this is the finished looks. I'm not really going to do any cheeks or lips um, because I don't feel like it and I don't need that to win because um, it's all about the eyes. Yeah, so this is it. Hope you like it. Um, I don't, but I hope you do. And um, yeah, that's about it. So I'll see you all soon. Bye.